Manchester will have one of its own leading the charge against Australia this weekend. Well, kind of. Whilst Adrian Morley was happy to relax at the team headquarters in the heart of Manchester, he's actually Salford born and bred, plays for Warrington and will be playing for England in Wigan. A true greater Manchester cosmopolitan then, and he's delighted that one of the biggest rivalries in rugby league is taking place in his own backyard. Wigan is a traditional stronghold of rugby league. Every time we've played Australia there, there's been a great crowd, and when they do get behind us, it does, does make a, a big difference. And we've, we've performed reasonably well there against the, the Kangaroos in the past, so uh, let's hope we can continue that. You know, Tony Smith, it's great that he's given youth a chance. He's picked players... Uh, if you're, if you're good enough, you're old enough, he's picked players on form, which is great. Uh, there's still a few old heads in there, as you say, but it's a really good mixture of experience and youth. And uh, team spirit's great, everything's going well, so it's, you know, we, we want to do well in this tournament, don't get me wrong, but as you say, it's also building for the future. Morley's not the only local player who will line up for England at the DW Stadium. Exciting Wigan prospect Sam Tompkins was the big selection made by coach Tony Smith when he announced his side to take on the Aussies. Tompkins is also relishing the chance of appearing in front of the North West fans and is glad to have Morley alongside him. Moz is a you know, massive massive player at, at Warrington and he's a, he's a real good bloke as well. And I think he's one of the key players for our team. You know, Texas gets some good for, go forward and yeah, I think he'll, he'll have a massive influence on the game. You know, the appetite for rugby around here is huge and it's, it's great that it's going to be in, in Wigan and you know, people from around, the, around these areas are going to be able to, be able to get behind us. The North West is one of the main hotbeds for rugby league in England. The Four Nations clash of the DW Stadium is a fitting reward for their support. We're delighted um, you know, that, it's a, that the game's so close to Manchester and we're hoping that a lot of people come and support us. And you know, It, it is a hotbed. There's, all around this area, is, there's tremendous players um, right on the doorstep. So um, you know, we, we're hoping that it you know, we put on a good performance, gets everybody behind us and uh, you know, we'll look for a, a, a really good support there on Saturday night. England will have to improve on their opening tournament performance against France to have any chance of competing with the might of the Australians. But with an exciting blend of youth and experience and some local talent, success may be in their grasp.